Now, when it comes to sneaker YouTube and all the reviews and stuff we see online, we're so used to Adidas runners and Jordan retros and the Pumas and the Converse's and all that kind of stuff. However, there is one realm of sneaker reviews that I don't really see uh, tapped into very much. And so that's what we are going to get into. We're going to review a pair of sneakers that originally came out in the 1980s and continue to be a mainstay in the 90s, the early 2000s, and still to this day in 2017. So today we're taking a look at the Adidas Campus in the navy blue colorway. One of the things you're gonna notice right away about these sneakers is just how clean and how simple these are. You don't have to be a sneakerhead to rock these. You're not gonna get a lot of street cred if you rock these, but you can pull together some really dope outfits. And these really just bring outfits together. These sneakers aren't necessarily going to be the center point of your fit. This version of the Adidas Campus I have right here features a pigskin nubuck upper. The material on this thing is really, really, really nice. They've recently dropped them in this navy blue color and they've also recently dropped them in a black and a gray so if you were looking to cop any of those colorways I'll leave links to the Adidas campus in the description down below for my Canadian and American viewers this sneaker is just so simple so basic and is honestly a staple for most people's collections especially if you're an Adidas head and you know not a hype beast first thing you're gonna notice is that deep navy blue pigskin nubuck upper we also got the leather three stripe branding on the side along with the campus branding as well. You also have the Adidas branding on the tongue too in white with that trefoil logo. You also have on the very back that same logo in navy blue on top of a white faux leather uh, back panel. Now the leather is also seen on the inside of the collar right here which is a nice nice touch in this navy blue color. One thing to note is that it's not real leather they use a faux leather for those accents. Now in terms of comfort and sizing I personally go half a size down in the Adidas campus and I find it to fit great. These are comfortable for all day wear. Uh, they have the Adidas Ortholite insole, so no problems there. The midsole and outsole of the shoe doesn't use that same white color as seen on the top of the shoe with the leather. Instead, it uses this off-white creamy color instead. Here's a look at the outsole as well and the traction. Now looking at the inside of the tongue, there's also some extra padding as well, so it's not like you're gonna have straight up nubuck rubbing against your uh, ankle. Now there really isn't too much I can say about this sneaker. I know that Misty Likes it? Yeah? Misty likes it, and I'm sure you might like these as well. There she goes, there she goes. That's Misty's brief little cameo in today's video. Can't go wrong with this on feet, coming up. That's my review of the Adidas Campus. Let me know what you guys think about this classic Adidas sneaker in the comment section down below. Have you ever owned a pair? Are you thinking about buying a pair now that I've reviewed it? Let me know what you guys think. Is it a cop? Is it a drop? Is it too basic? Is it not your style? And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.